this is a growing microtubule and this is a shrinking microtubule or depolymerizing microtubule both the microtubules have minus end and plus end the end of the growing microtubule has a blunt end whereas the shrinking microtubule has curls like horn of ram these are the tubulin protofilaments in growing microtubule and shrinking microtubule each tubulin protofilament has alpha beta tubulin dimers each alpha beta tubulin dimer consists of an alpha tubulin protein and a beta tubulin protein the microtubule having gdp beta tubulin at the end of the protofilaments generally forms a curved structure and undergoes rapid disassembly due to this rapid disassembly fragments of protofilament and alpha beta tubulin dimers are formed the fragments of protofilament are made up of repeating alpha beta tubulin dimer the beta tubulins in both fragments of protofilament and alpha beta tubulin dimers are bound to gdp so the beta tubulins in both fragments of protofilament and alpha beta tubulin dimers are called as gdp beta tubulin the gdp is bound to beta tubulins of both fragments of protofilament and alpha beta tubulin dimers then dissociate the gdp is then bind to the beta tubulins of both fragments of protofilament and alpha beta tubulin dimers as a result alpha beta tubulin dimers are formed in which each beta tubulin is bound to one gtp the beta tubulin in its gtp bound state is called as gtp beta tubulin these alpha beta tubulin dimers having a gtp beta tubulin each then assemble at the plus end of a growing microtubule the growing microtubule can undergo catastrophe to form shrinking microtubule and the shrinking microtubule can undergo rescue to form the growing microtubule this process of alternating between growing and shrinking states is known as dynamic instability the rate of switching between growing and shrinking state of the microtubule is regulated by associated proteins the plus end of microtubule is subject to dynamic instability please like subscribe and share